the successor to the Hubble Space Telescope has been delayed yet again and will not now launch until approximately May 2020. The James Webb Space Telescope is also in danger of busting the cost cap put on the project by the U.S. Congress. Back in 2011, politicians on Capitol Hill said the observatory should not take more than $8 billion to build and $800 million to operate over five years in orbit. At the beginning of each fiscal year funds are allocated to each state account in accordance with the university's financial plan. Funds are allocated to each account by objective expenditure. Account managers are responsible for ensuring that adequate funds are available in the appropriate object before initiating transactions to use the funds. While blue is one of the most popular colors, it is one of the least appetizing. Blue food is rare in nature. Food researchers say that when humans searched for food, they learned to avoid toxic or spoiled objects, which were often blue, black or purple. When food dyed blue is served to study objects, they lose appetite. Although it comes from a remote region in the Himalayas, this plant now looks entirely at home on the banks of English rivers. Brought to the UK in 1839-1839 it quickly escaped, colonizing riverbanks and damp woodlands. Now it is spreading across Europe, New Zealand and Canada. In the Himalayas the plant is held in check by various pests, and it grows and reproduces unhindered.
How do we imagine the unimaginable? If we are asked to think of an object as a Y, a yellow tulip, a picture immediately forms in our minds by question mark but what if we try to imagine a concept such as the square root of a negative number? The core of the problem was the immense disparity between the country's productive capacity and the ability of people to consume. Great innovations in productive techniques during and after the war raised the output of industry beyond the purchasing capacity of U.S. farmers and wage earners. Pluto lost its official status when the International Astronomical Union downsized the solar system from nine to eight planets. Although there had been passionate debate at the IAU General Assembly meeting in Prague about the definition of a planet, and whether Pluto met the specifications, the audience greeted the decision to exclude it with applause. Ever since I remembered, Father woke up at 5.30 every morning, made us all breakfast and read newspaper. After that he would go to work. He worked as a writer. It was a long time before I realized he did this for a living. Although Botswana's economic outlook remains strong, the devastation that AIDS has caused threatens to destroy a country's future. In 2001, Botswana has the highest rates of HIV infection in the world. With the help of international donors, it launched an ambitious national campaign that provided free antiviral drugs to anyone who need them, and by March 2004, Botswana's infection rate has dropped significantly.
New research shows that during the global financial crisis, workers who stayed in jobs did not reduce their working hours, despite the claims that cuts in hours have led to job losses. A study found that the life of people who stayed with the same employer remained relatively unchanged. Life expectancy has increased dramatically in the last century. Most people these days will live for over 70 years. This is more than double the lifespan of the average human in the 17th century. We can attribute our longevity to advances in medicine and lifestyle. While everyone agrees that living longer is wonderful, overpopulation is becoming a serious environmental concern. You may have heard of the new fad known as ecotourism. This means tourism which is environmentally friendly and conscious about conserving the environment. The key is to minimize the physical, social and behavioral impacts of overseas travel. Tour groups will often work with local and indigenous communities to design respectful and memorable programs for visitors. Charles Darwin published his paper on the origin of species in 1859. It is one of the most well-known pieces of scientific literature in human history. In the paper, Darwin proposes the theory of natural selection. He states that for any generation of any species, there will always be a struggle for survival. Individuals who are better suited to the environment are fitter. In an attempt to lure new students, leading business schools, including Harvard, Stanford, the University of Chicago and Wharton, have moved away from the unofficial missions and prerequisite of four years work experience and instead have set their sights on recent college graduates and so-called early career professionals, with only a couple years of work under their belt.
food is one of the most important things you'll ever buy. And yet most people never bother to think about their food and where it comes from. People spend a lot more time worrying about what kind of blue jeans to wear, what kind of video games to play, and what kind of computers to buy. Global Management is a program specially designed to equip students with the knowledge and skills required to become an effective leader in diverse business contexts and varied intercultural settings. The program acknowledges that contemporary markets are increasingly complex in terms of culture and demand, that information and communication are crucial for success, and that social responsibility for sustainability and corporate entrepreneurship are crucial. marriage is a big step in anyone's life and there is an argument to be made against getting married too early. As any newlywed couple knows, there is a huge amount of financial pressure associated with marriage. Firstly, the wedding reception and honeymoon will cost you an arm and a leg. Then there's a matter of home loans, rent and energy bills. If you're looking to start a family, your child's education is another thing you need to save up for. Teenagers should probably find the proper job before deciding to tie the knot. If you have a chronic disease such as heart disease, diabetes, asthma, or back or joint pain, exercise can have important health benefits. However, it is important to talk to your doctor before starting an exercise routine. He or she might have advice on what exercises are safe and any precautions you might need to take while exercising.